ER720 here, and today I am outside in the BBYC, the backyard bushcraft area, or whatever I want to call it. What is it called? Backyard BY, is the BYBCA, the bush, the backyard bushcraft area. <laughs> That's it. And have an unboxing. This is an important unboxing. Me and a buddy of mine slipped this. We're talking about this, and yeah, anyways, I'm outside and I'm unboxing it. So, let me see. I got Kershaw Dozer. Or not Kershaw Dozer. Why is it called a Kershaw? K-Bar. I don't know why I call it Kershaw, y'all. Sorry about that. K-Bar Dozer. I had a guy at work tell me that this knife was Country Boy Shard. <laughs> Thought that was kind of funny. I mean... For those, this knife is country boy sharp. See, I got. You gonna need that paper? Alright, if the wind's blowing, I do apologize. But I do hear, have here. K bar. I really like this box. I think they redid their boxes. K bar, USMC, Marine Corps utility knife with the leather sheath. Unboxing of the USMC K bar. And what I'm going to do is do some edge testing straight out the box. Y'all saw it straight out the box? Let's see, what is this? A little bit of packing info. Not bad, pretty short. When the wind's not blowing. Not bad. First one pass. Let me put this up. I really do dig that, uh, the new box that the uh, K-Bars are coming out. I'm going to put all my uh, sharpening supplies in this box. I like that a lot. Sheath is really nice. Water bottle. That's what that is. I'm pretty sure y'all looked at it and said, yep, that's a water bottle there, Biggie. All right. Water bottle cut cut test straight out the box should probably do this one last because it's gonna get me wet it did good it was my bad on the hit but it did good let's see Trying to stay away from all body parts, so I don't hurt myself. It's not bad, that was probably about inch thick, but I needed it for something else. See what I can do. I'm not gonna try to baton this big old chunk of wood in half because it's a big old chunk of wood. But I am going to try just to take a piece of the corner off because I don't want to overdo the knife. But I want to see if it'll do it. So far, that piece broke.
Well, I'm impressed. Let's see, where's that paper at? I guess it's just me with this crinkled up paper. It's still sharp, it's just the paper's all crinkled up. Shouldn't have did that. Oh yeah. Very cool. I like the knife, it feels really good in the hand. This is that knife that is on everybody's list of knives to buy, but they never buy it. I say, I recommend going out and buying it. It's a great knife. Y'all take it easy. ER720, signing out.